cheer for our movement family. May the peace of our Lord Jesus Christ be with each one of you. Every year, surrender to the pages of history is punctuated with events that make it meaningful. For the Reform Movement, 2023 was a year of doubled efforts to hasten the Lord's coming. Since the pandemic, our movement has been established in seven new countries. Lesotho, Ivory Coast, Bangladesh, the Central African Republic, the Grand Cayman Islands, Gabon, Swaziland. During the last months of this year, the work has begun in Mauritius and Guinea-Bissau, and the workers are on their way to Benin and Sudan. The prayers and support of our brethren around the world, including you, are important to this work. Please keep them in your prayers. Around the world, our brethren have been actively living and sharing the gospel message. And in January, the GC held its annual council in Colombia as a preview of the upcoming General Conference. The General Conference session will be here in Moniquirá in January 2025. Can't wait to see you there. In several countries, the Brethren united in the distribution of hope through literature. Humanitarian mission trips took assistance to those who needed it and left the Gospel's impression in the hearts of the communities. Brethren gathered for a conference in numbers larger than before the pandemic. In April, the second annual music camp took place in Honduras. In the summer of 2023, the Reform Movement was busy with an international mission trip that spanned three locations. Missionary school graduation took place in the U.S. and Colombia. And workers' seminars across the world helped workers refresh their knowledge and motivated them to continue in the Lord's cause. Aware of the challenge that families are facing, we have held numerous marriage and family seminars and prepared materials for our engaged couples to help them establish a happy future with God at the center. In September, the Brethren from the Media Studio in Sao Paulo organized a campaign to offer support, education, and hope to those who find themselves combating depression and anxiety. Over 600,000 magazines were distributed with topics under the theme it's not your fault. The magazines had QR codes that once scanned took the person to the studios, Spotify, and YouTube, where more content awaited them. Additionally, 
they had access to counseling from pastors and professional support. We praise the Lord. Ebenezer, hitherto has the Lord helped us. As we look forward to the year ahead of us, I want to personally invite you to trust your future to the Lord. He has blessings for you that you cannot imagine. Surrender your heart and plans to Him. I would like to invite you to our next worldwide gathering as a core movement family. On February 6 to 9, 2025, we will gather in Medellin, Colombia for our 24th General Conference. It will be a special occasion where we gather to reflect on the 100 years of our church's history. It will be a time of spiritual refreshing and a call to arise and shine. We nurture the hope that this will be the last general conference before the Lord's return. So don't miss it. Embark on an adventure in 2025. Come, fellowship with your brethren, make new friends, visit a new country, and most importantly, draw closer to our Lord. I hope, by God's grace, to see you there.